And this just coming out of Pyongyang, North Korea says today that it had arrested a U.S. tourist back in April, claiming that the man violated the country's laws. The arrest marks the third American to be detained in the secretive state. Our Yulian reports. North Korea announced that it detained a man named Jeffrey Edward Paule, who is being investigated for carrying out acts it deems as inappropriate for a tourist. Pyongyang state-run Korean Central News Agency reported the arrest on Friday, adding that he had entered North Korea earlier on April 29th. Japanese news agency Kyoto, citing diplomatic sources, reported that he was arrested about two weeks after his arrival for leaving a Bible at a hotel that he was staying at. The U.S. State Department has yet to confirm the report, but if confirmed, it means there is now a total of three Americans held in custody by the regime. The two others include another U.S. tourist, Matthew Todd Miller, who was arrested back in April. North Korea claims Miller demanded asylum in the communist state. The other is Kenneth Bay, who has been jailed since November 2012 and sentenced to 15 years of hard labor under charges of trying to overthrow the government. Pyongyang has rejected visits by U.S. Special Envoy for North Korean Human Rights Issues Robert King to discuss Bay's case. Yurian, Arirang News.